For the exhibition, Women Heal Through Rite and Ritual, I chose two works, A Song Flung Up to Heaven and Kindred. I let the wood decide the theme that fits whether it's going to be a story of age, beauty, spiritualism, healing, femininity, etc. I then spent hours researching the images. After choosing what images I want to use, I often have them printed in different sizes to help with building the composition and creating a sense of scale with the work. Then the work is then layered, distressed, and painted and adorned. In consideration of a song flung up to heaven, I focus on the theme of spirituality in the Christian church. The images are pulled from the National Library of Congress and the Getty Archives. I chose this wood panel because it was broken, as are many of those coming into the Christian church, and look towards religion as a means of healing. The work has sunflowers in it as a symbol of guidance. Uh, I like sunflowers. They're one of my favorite flowers. And the guidance that I was referring to is the idea that those who come to church are looking for someone to guide them. The colors are bright and are meant to reflect a galaxy that the figures float within. You will often see dots, orbs, or circles in my work because a sphere is infinite with no beginning or end. They are often viewed as a symbol of femininity and in my mind, they remind me of the dots of light that are the stars we see from earth reflected in the heavens. Kindred. A lot of my work starts with the wood, which is sourced from donations and foraging from various locations. I let the wood speak to me, per se, as far as what story I need to tell with it. In the case of the panel in respect to Kindred, I was attracted to the curved lines and the age wear of the wood along the top. My work Kindred is near and dear to my heart. It was inspired by the idea of family. The central figures are all females because they are the matriarchs who are looked at as the glue that holds communities and especially families together. These women are most often the educators and healers. They are the keepers of traditions that are passed on from generation to generation despite adversity. Thus, they are the soul of a family. In my work, you'll see burning and gouging of the wood to create depth and layers. In this work, I used rich earth tones and hand painted some of the black and white prints to add dimension as a means of showing kinship with Africa. Another way of showing the same connection to the motherland, I often paint tribal markings on the images and adorn with metallics to akin to the connections of our lost lives in Africa and our possible links to African royalty.